Hey guys, Dustin here, CEO of 630. Today we're going to do a 20 mile ride on our e-bikes with senior over, seniors over 60. Stick around. Okay, so we're here with our first rider, rider Marsha. We just want to introduce you to her, get to know a little bit about her bike riding history. So Marsha, welcome to our ride, our 20 mile e-bike ride. So tell me, when's the last time you rode a normal bike? It's been a couple years. Okay. It's been a couple years. And you were saying you had knee surgery? Or yes. You, okay. Yes, I had a total knee replacement. How long ago? Uh, about four years ago. Four years And haven't ridden a bike since then? Um, I, stationary bikes. Stationary bikes. Okay. Yeah. So first time today back on an upright two-wheel bike. That's kind of exciting. And never been on an electric bike. Nope. First, first time. time. Wow. And Marsha actually, it was off camera. She was getting comfortable with it but now she's up rocking and rolling. So it's truly anybody can do it. Take some time to get adjusted. But today we're gonna take her on 20 mile ride with an e-bike. So we're gonna see post knee surgery, how she does. It's exciting. Okay, Marsha, and how old are you? I'm 68. Marsha, 68. All right, let's meet our new rider, our next rider. Okay, now we're here with Mike. <laughs> And Mike, how old are you? I'm 114 last week. Okay. I look good. In dog I mean, years. How no, old I'm, in human I'm years? I'm 70. 70. 70. Okay. 70. I just turned 70. Okay, cool. Well, man, am I pretty. Oh. Okay. okay. And when's the last time you rode a bike? All the time. I'm a truck guy, a couple of trucks. Okay, so yeah. you're always on a bike. Uh, yeah, a lot. Not always, yeah. Okay. <laughs> and e bike? I never had one, never tried one. First time today First actually trying time. it. First time. This okay. will be awesome. Cool. They're beautiful. Great. Well, I'm glad you like it. Yeah, so this will man. be exciting. So we're going to take Mike on his first e-bike ride ever today. So we'll see how he does. Okay, now we've got Phil. And Phil, how old are you? I'm 81. Wow. Phil looks great for you. I, wasn't even, I was not expecting that. You look great. Well, I'm glad you're surprised. Yeah, no. Um, I, I swim a lot. I'm a swimmer, a surfer and swimmer. Great. Um, and last time you rode a bike? Stationary bike has been quite a while. I My son has four or five. My son, grandchildren, and so forth have a four or five electric bikes. I've ridden them one. I tried it once. One time. And then okay. they wouldn't let me, they took it and left. So, you okay. know, I, mean, I shared. So after that today, first time really getting familiar riding it around. Yes. And I'm really looking forward to it. Cool. That's amazing. So Phil 81, he's going to come on the ride 20 miles with the e-bike. Stick around. Let's meet our next rider. Okay. And last but not least, we have Carol Ann. And Carol Ann, how old are you? I'm 72. 72. Okay. And when's the last time you were on a regular bike? Oh, regular bike, uh, it's been a couple of months. A couple of months, okay. Mm -hmm. An e-bike? No. Never? No. Well, Today's the first time? Yeah. How, so far, so good? How did so you? So far, great. Okay, yeah. cool. Yeah, very comfy. That's great. So there we go. We've got Carol Ann, who's 72, and the rest of our riders. Let's get saddled up and ready to ride out. Okay, we are all saddled up. Before we get going, I'm going to go ahead and start my app. There we go, ride stars. Everyone ready? Ready. All right, let's do this. Okay, here we are. We made it to mile five, so we're 25% of the way there. And how's everyone feeling? Great. We're good. Great. Terrific. Yeah. Unbelievable. Doing great. Um, so, Marsha, give us some thoughts. How, yeah. how easy is it with the e-bike? It, like... it was so much easier than I thought it was going to be. I was a little nervous at first because I haven't been on a bike in a long time. It's a piece of cake. Cool. It really is. All right. 
And Phil, you're riding right behind me. How are you feeling so far? I'm great. I'm great. You know, 81 years old, you want to be confident, <laughs> feel relaxed, and enjoy yourself. Well, I got tons of that with this. Cool. Terrific. Cool. And Mike, what do you think? Yeah, 117 I'm years old right 114 here. years oh, 14, old. But okay. I, I bike, I bike. But these, my first time on the e-bike, this really, true, I'm not saying this because the boss is standing here. <laughs> this is really a great assistance if you want to ride a bicycle. Because even with headwinds, you'll you'll be saved. You'll be, you really will be that. So I'm just curious, amazing. so when you rode here, did you, what, did, what level assistance did you have it in, or did you use the throttle? Level one. one. Level I didn't one? Use the throttle. No. No throttle, no throttle, level one. Level one. Yeah. And which bike were you on? The black one. The black one. Hey, Alana, can you turn his bike on and tell us how much battery he has left? Yeah. Okay, cool. So we're five miles in. My battery's full. I was teetering between one and two on the assistance. Um, and we're averaging 13 miles an hour. And we're, we're about 5.43 miles according to the 630 app, so download that, track your rides. And um, I'm full battery. I just checked Phil's. Yeah. He's full battery. And what were, what were you doing on the... Well, I was between one and two. One and two? Pedaling intermittently when I felt like it and relaxed. And used the throttle when I wanted to. I get total control. So yeah. you did a little throttle? I did some throttle. I did some one and two. Hey, I'm having a great time. Cool. I did the same. You did the same? I did exactly the same. So Marsha's yep. battery did die, but we think that's more related to the lack of charging. We pulled all the bikes out of the showroom, so we have some new ones, some old ones. We tried to switch them all out, so we've got her on a new battery now. Um, my, my gut tells me her battery wasn't full when we started. And then Carol Ann, how about you? How do you feel so far? Good? Great. I had it between one and two, a little bit of throttle, still have a full battery. I was amazed at how quickly I became comfortable with the whole pedal assist and the throttle system. I am loving that throttle system to get on the bike to start with, loving it. Yeah, I was a little, we did go through a little bit of a busy area, which had me a little nervous with the whole biker brigade. But uh, now we're gonna be on some straight, easy paths and we can cruise at pedal assist two and three and probably still be going 13, 14, 15 miles an hour. So we're a quarter of the way there. We're gonna get back on the bikes, come along. All right, so we are, according to the 630 app, 8.36 miles in, and um, we are taking a quick break from, from photo opportunities. Everyone seems to be holding up great, and uh, I think we're gonna make it the full 20. Coming back may be a little more challenging. We're gonna have some uphills to deal with, but um, we got extra batteries. So I got a full battery. I've been using anywhere from one to three and a little bit of throttle. And I think we're averaging about 13 miles an hour. Pete right here hasn't even touched the electric. He's just going the whole way. And Alana's bike's right here. She's at full battery. Yeah. And Alana, what are you doing? Pedaling on and off? Yeah. How, what level I, assistance, one? I try to keep it at one, but when it gets wow. early, I ramp it up. Too. Okay. And uh, I think, let's just check the bikes really quick. Here's the app too, if you want to get a shot of that. So we're at one hour, five minutes. I'm just letting it run so we get the full gamut of the ride. And let's see, so this is Mike's bike. Full battery, hasn't been switched yet. And um, this is Marsha. 
So Marsha had to have a battery change, but we think it was dead, so she's at full battery right now. And um, let's make our way over here to yeah, Carol Ann. It wasn't even half before. Oh, really? That's probably why. Yeah. yeah. When I saw the whole My husband, we thing. ride down here all the time. Okay. So. And here's Phil. And here he is. And okay. Phil, he's at full battery. Full battery. At 81, right? Yeah. What a guy. Unbelievable. I'm so light on my feet. <laughs> and Caroline, you're at full battery? I am. Full battery, wow. Yeah. And everyone's think, feeling good? Yeah, yeah. doing great. We're, let's go. Okay, it's no stopping? Yeah. All right, so here. Let's go 50 miles. 50 it is. All right, we're gonna get back, suited up, and start the ride again. All right, so we've got a lot of gear packed in case of an emergency, since this is a pretty long ride, starting with some sunscreen. A tube in here, this Allen wrench tool. I think in here we have some more Another tube and some additional tools. Haven't needed anything so far. Knock on wood. Back here, I have, I think we loaded all of our bikes, pretty much all of the 630 employee bikes with an extra battery, but I don't think we'll be needing it. Most of us have full batteries, but you can see, I have another one here on this side too. Bag is holding up. Haven't noticed the extra weight, but I'm in pretty good shape. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you can see more rides like this. Let us know what else you want to see. Bike demos, trike demos, ride-alongs, pet videos. Those are my favorite. And don't forget to join the Peddlers group and download the app. Um, I'm hoping to be in first place on the leaderboard after this ride, but I might have to put in an extra mile or two to beat our videographer. Okay, so we are at mile 12 and a half. Uh, we're doing it. I am excited to see that everyone's still going. And um, I still have a full battery, and it looks like Mike right here's got full battery. We are in the Dana Point, um, Doheny Beach, and we just went through the harbor. So we're about to hit a straight shot back towards uh, our offices. And I think we're gonna do 20 easy at this point. So. Uh, seven and a half miles to go, and um, how you feeling, Phil? Great. Phil's this again. Let's get going. How about 50 <laughs> miles. I'm ready. Yeah. Phil doesn't want to stop. Put me in. Oh, Phil, how you doing, oh, Mike? Phil. We're good. Life is good. Life is good. All right. Especially on uphills, it's really good. <laughs> <laughs> Makes well, it so easy. Yeah. We'll talk to uh, Marsha too, because Marsha was definitely a little unsteady in the morning. Um, I think even some questions around if she would make it or not. So we're 12 and a half miles in, and she's still with us so she's taking a little bathroom break we're all taking bathroom breaks when she comes out we'll talk to her okay so we're gonna talk to marcia so marcia when we got when we first got on the bikes what were you thinking in your head were you thinking you were gonna make it i was miles? i i was well i i was a little scared at first because i haven't been on a bike in so long yeah and uh then once i got going i it was it was just great i can do this so you're 12 and a half miles in Woohoo! <laughs> How do you feel now, like, on it? You feel more confident? Yeah. 
And how I do you do. like? How's the electric good? You like it's it? It's doing great. It's it's wonderful. It's absolutely wonderful. I can't imagine riding a regular bike again. <laughs> <laughs> and how's your knee been then? Like, with... oh, my knee's fine. My knee's been fine. I mean, it, it's not great. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it hasn't hurt it. Your only trouble is just sort of getting over the step through the yeah. on and off. Okay. Oh, we got some yep. birds. Cool. So we got seven and a half miles to go, and you feel you're ready. I can do this. What I want. Yeah, baby. <laughs> All right. So we're going to do this. We're going to get back on, and uh, hopefully the crows don't attack us. And uh, seven and a half miles to go. We'll make probably one more stop before we get back on the busy street and head back up to our offices. But uh, just one more blanket question. Anyone feeling any pain, soreness, back pain anywhere? No. Nothing. No. Yeah, my hands were a little stiff, but they're okay now. Okay. Caroline, your butt a little bit sore, you were saying? I know I've done something. Okay. Other than that, so no pain really. That's great. That's the comfort, fit, and design for custom adjustment points. Don't forget yeah. about those. And uh, I was going to just do a quick review of who's riding what. So Marsha's on the body ease, which is perfect. Body ease, easy on the body. Everyone's got a 500 watt today. So Marsha's on the body ease, 500 watt, the step through version. Phil's on the around the block, 500 watt, our new color combos. I've been around the block a few times. <laughs> it's fitting. <laughs> I'm on the Every Journey, 500 watt. Nate, behind the cameras, on the Reach Your Destination, 500 watt. Alana's on the Around the Block, 500 watt. Carol Ann is on the Ride in the Park, step through. Nice upright. Peter here is on the Ride in the Park, but this guy's just a beast. He chooses to go no electric. And uh, Mike is on the Reach Your Destination also. So he's got some thinner tires on the Reach Your Destination, as does Pete. Those roll a little smoother. But everyone's got a different bike and everyone's feeling comfortable, so that's exciting. Let's back up a little bit here. And uh, let's do this. Let's mount up and hit the next seven and a half miles. Okay, we are here, ride's complete. I'm with Phil and Marsha. Right. And um, give us your final thoughts, recap, how'd you enjoy the ride? I, I thought it was terrific. I loved it, every part of it. I can't think of anything negative. And I want to do it again. I'm ready to go. I'm, you know, take a break maybe, but I'm ready. It was, it was great. I had the confidence and comfort, and everything I needed, and I loved it. I love it. What, so how's your body feeling right now? Any soreness? I feel terrific. I don't, I have no, you know, I'm ready to dance or <laughs> play basketball or whatever. And like, so we just did 20 miles. Um, 20 miles. How about that? Have you ever done 20 miles on a bike? No, I don't know. I don't think so. I can, maybe when I was a kid and, you know, went somewhere, but I don't believe so. Yeah. I used to ride to school for a few miles and so forth. But no, I think that was probably the longest probably, I've ever yeah. done. And I feel great. So we just hit a milestone. Your first 20 mile bike ride at 81. That's right. I'll be back when 91. <laughs> no, I'll just say stay tuned for next week. We'll push him to 30 miles. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah, thank you. So, Marsha, how are you feeling? 
I feel great. I'm and by the way, I was to say I just caught Marsha inside calling her husband to celebrate that she made it 20 miles on a bike. True story, right? I thought it was going to be 10. He thought it was going to be 10, and he goes, "Do you think you could do that?" So I called him up and said, "I did 20." <laughs> and how are you feeling physically? I feel great. We want to. We want to get bikes. Definitely, we want to get them there. It's a fabulous product. I. I've, I've never had a better ride, and I've never gone 20 miles on a bike before either. And I saw, um, you were, well, you were telling me inside that the last time you rode was like seven years ago or More something. More than seven. More than seven years. More than seven years ago. It's the first time I've been on a bike. Crazy. And yeah. on the way back, we went up a pretty major hill, so you went on the throttle, which is good. Yeah. That's what it's there for. And how was that experience then? It made it easier, nice? Piece of cake. Made it really easy when you get tired of pedaling. You just put on the throttle and off you go. And I checked Marsha's battery. She had about half left. So we switched her battery out about five miles in because we forgot to give her a full battery. So she made it 15 miles, used the throttle for, what do you think, like half of that 15? At or least, yeah, Okay, it's so maybe half or more. And she made it back with half a battery. And Phil, how was your battery? It was about great. It's got over half. Over half. And I used well, I had a combination of one, two, three, and... And uh, the throttle, I use the throttle a bit, but boy, it was great, and I think I could have gone on and on. Coming up the big hill here on the way back, did you ever use four or five, or you stayed in no, three? No, I never, I, I didn't want to waste the battery. I didn't, it turns out it didn't matter. I could have, but I just felt more confident, and uh, I didn't want to didn't run out of battery, so I wasn't sure, so I just did three. Three and pedaling some and not. It was great, perfect. So. Truth be told, as I put it in level five for that uphill on the last stretch. Well, so, you're way more so <laughs> well, <laughs> I appreciate that. No, no, I mean I appreciate you making me try to feel better about my right, level right, five right, usage. Right, right, right. <laughs> and then, Mike, how about you? So, you, um, how do you feel right now? I've got to tell you, every option on the bike, <laughs> no, that we were told about, really, really did what they said it would do. These tools, this is a tool, I think, this is my opinion only, this would be amazing for medicinal rehab or cardiac rehab or people that want to try to get more exercise because when you fatigue from pedaling, the motor kicks in with a push of a button and you, you go through the headwinds and you go, we just covered a yep. serious uphill, yep. right up the hill with no pedaling. It's perfect for rehab. It really is. And how much battery life, did, what, what level did you use coming up the hill? Three. Three. And I didn't touch 4,000. I didn't, it was, it, it was great. Wow. The bike really delivered. It wasn't any BS about it. There you have it. So we made it our 20 miles, just shy of 20 miles. Um, we're going to call it 20 miles. And the bikes were a success. All right, so the ride is over. Our over 60 senior riders all made it to 20 miles. It's gonna be like 19.6. You can check the app that we put into the video, but they did it. We took on major hills and they all had fun. Um, Marsha, Phil, Mike, and Carol Ann, they all did it. Um, and Phil being 81, so you can see over 60. We had 68, 72 today. The electric bike really can get you back out riding and make it so much easier. And you heard it right there, no one had even ridden 20 miles in their entire life and they did it on an e-bike. The e-bikes really can expand horizons. So if you have any other questions about anything you saw today in the video, wanna know more about the bike models they were riding or the power, anything, Comment below, we'll always respond or email us, the team at 630.com or call us 310-982-2877. And don't forget, if you're in the market for an e-bike, visit our website, 630.com and take our proprietary body fit algorithm quiz. It's gonna ask you some questions about your body and your life and fit you to the perfect e-bike for you. And don't forget, we have a 90 day test ride your e-bike policy. If you don't love your e-bike in 90 days, send it back, no questions asked, no money out of your pocket. In addition to that, we have a 365 day warranty. So after your 90 day test ride is over, we're still gonna warranty the e-bike for 365 days, taking care of any problems you may have. And lastly, be a part of our community, join our Facebook peddlers group or download our app. You can see other riders using the app that we use today. You can track rides and you'll see the actual bikes that we rode 
today in the app so you can see others and how many miles they log on their bikes or e-bikes. You can compete on the leaderboard and log miles and do our challenges and also be a part of our people pedaling challenge. We're trying to log 150,000 miles on the app this year. Lastly, join our Facebook Pedalers group either before you purchase or after. Before, it's a great place to talk to other riders, see their bikes, ask questions, and once you have a bike, you can make friends, post photos, and have a lot of fun. So thank you for sticking around on our ride today, and don't forget, it's your journey, your experience. Enjoy the ride.